What's up you guys? I'm Carter and today I got another fun adventure for you guys. Actually behind me right now is the crematorium, which I've done a couple videos here uh, in the past couple months and now that it's getting warmer I really want to come back here. I've never been inside and that's what today's video is all about. I'm ready to go inside. I am a little nervous um, because on the way in there was a gazebo and uh, it looked like it had some uh, like a pillow and some stuff in it so I'm assuming a homeless person was either in the area or still is in the area so I do have to be careful because if he's been wandering around here he knows that you can get in this place too so I hope you guys are ready for this adventure it's gonna be a quick one because I gotta go to work after this but I really wanted to bring you guys along and show you what's inside because I've never been in so this is gonna be a first for both of us Let's get started. All right, you guys, so I know the entrance is over here, so we're just gonna see if I can get inside, and if so, it's gonna be a real quick investigation because I only have like 20 minutes till I gotta leave, but. I'm gonna put you guys in there. I'm gonna set you guys up and then I'm gonna climb in. I'm officially inside of this crematorium. Now, there's a door over there. It says employees only. So I think we have to go in there, but check this out. Is there all like, I guess people's ashes. Got a stinky smell in it, but I'm sure there's been animals in here. It's got eggs in there. I'm not fucking with that. That scared the shit out of me. Okay, so that really wasn't anything exciting, I guess. That's just where the bodies were cremated. I'd love to come in here and do an investigation. I think I'm gonna actually pull out the uh, ghost tube right now and see if I can get anything. Okay, so ghost tube. Um, uh, I already put my phone on airplane mode, as you can see. Airplane mode. So I'm gonna set it down on this table here. Are there any spirits that would like to talk to me? You can speak to me through my phone, use the energy from my camera or my phone to communicate. My name is Carter. Why? It's always scary when it first starts. Why am I here? Because I'm curious as to how many people have come through here, sadly. There's still some urns here. So I'm assuming some spirits reside. What should I do? Can you tell me what year you died?
can you give me a name of somebody who may have died in here? this place and I just recently found out but I'm very intrigued all right guys so this is a lot less um, scary than what I expected I expected there to be like a bigger area because this place looks so big but really it's just super high ceilings it's a beautiful structure it's very open in here and then i'm assuming this was a very sad time in people's lives but i walked through a spider web but do you not want me to be here You can tell me to get out, and I will. Attic. You. There isn't an attic in this place. Can you give me any name, and I will leave? How do you feel? To be honest, right now, a little nervous. I keep watching that window. In case I see anybody like walk by, my stuff is out there, so. This is strange. Do you not have company often? I want to go in there, but there's friggin' birds. Don't go in there. I know, I'm not gonna go in there. Those birds scare me. Are you okay that I'm in here? Do you enjoy my company? You can speak to me, I'm friendly. I bet it's lonely in here. Or maybe there's a lot in here. close. I have to leave soon. Can you give me any information? A name, a year. Soon. There's a road right on the other side of the cemetery. So that was it's a no. Now, if you guys have been watching me for a while, um, you know I use GhostTube, and here recently I started using it, and I've been getting a lot more different responses and I don't know if it's the location the energy um, just the app itself but it's pretty cool hearing different things come from it it is a little scary um, definitely intuition and like putting things together thinking what they could possibly be trying to communicate so it's definitely a fun time i am gonna say goodbye now to all the spirits of this crematorium 
I hope that I didn't disturb you. Thank you. Are annoying. <laughs> Thank you for being honest with me. Um, I will be back one day. So don't go anywhere, ghost. So I'm gonna leave this place and I'll pick up while I'm heading out. All right, you guys, I wanna thank you so much for coming along on this adventure for me. This is where I'm gonna end it. I have to go to work, sadly. I wanted to spend more time in the crematorium and just kind of feel it out. It was a little uh, spooky. I actually honestly left because I heard noises and thought people were outside, but it was nobody. I don't know what I heard. Maybe uh, it was from the road. I don't know. I'll have to rewatch the footage and see what that was. Um, I do plan on coming back here at night and kind of going inside, but I feel more comfortable now that I've been inside, so look out for that video. Um, I got more coming. It's getting super nice out, so I keep telling you guys this, but it's true. I'm going to keep posting videos, so get ready for a summer of adventures. Thank you guys for coming along with me. Um, like and subscribe. I'll catch you on the next one.